So Thatcher's been chopped. Fuck's sake. He was outnumbered. I couldn't reach him. Devil damn the man he was faced with his arms divided. It's hard to let go of the life you know best. My own idiot father liked to brag about how he went to purchase a ship of his own. I'll get a privateering contract, Charlie. Your old dad'll be a captain. Drowned in a whiskey bottle before he ever last show. Right, Kenway. I've been musing on this plan of yours. This observatory you're always going on about. How do we know it exists? We find a slave ship called the Princess. Aboard should be a man called Roberts. He can lead us to it. Well, them slavers work for the Royal African Company. Find one of their ships and start asking some questions. What's our course, Captain? We're looking for slave ships. Any that work for the Royal African Company. You don't mean to traffic human cargo now, do you? No, Jesus, Annie. You know me better than that. We're only after information. Looking to find where the princess docks in the spare time. The princess? The slave ship? Right. Blackbeard told me there's a good chance we'd find the sage aboard her. Captain, Vince just sunk a merchant schooner. <laughs> Damn. Can't that animal stay the course we agreed to? <laughs> no way, like. Don't sink that slave ship, can we? There's hundreds of innocent men aboard. I know, I know. This is our boat, how about? Got it. Captain, the slave ship is running. Damn fool. I'll get it. Don't shoot him! Shit! Shoot him! Yes, shoot Clear, 
我就让他完成了一项是要挑战，是要目标。今晚来登船，我们来干坏事。这里有人，我要他。没的。他的。哦，这好多人。没炸到多少。来，我们跳跳跳，冲冲冲，冲！哎呦！哎，他们。好了好了好了，不打了，不想去了。没有狙击手卡还是，突然变得好，很安静。哎，上来，上来，上来！重新进入，上来，上来！And um, well, they figured I'd be a fitter captain than you reckless dogs. I'll cut you another cut, Tracer. <laughs> This one I figure I might sell for a tenner down in Kingston, but uh, with you two grog blossoms, I can't take any chances. You regret this day, Rackham. I regret most of them already. Tie him up. Cast him off. 
with the fishermen and their dories, can we? This island's mine! Come at me and I'll cap you, bastard! It was your bloody imagination that landed us here, can we? I'll be damned if I let that mine make one more decision for me! Will you not talk to me, Vane? Are you fixed on this madness? Madness? <laughs> Nothing mad about a man fighting to survive, is there? I mean you no harm, you corker! Now let's work this out like gentlemen. Oh, God, I've got a bleeding headache on account of your jabbering. Now stay back and let me live in peace. I would if you stop filching the food I gather and the water I find. I'll stop nothing till you bait me back in blood. You was the reason we were out looking for slavers. And you was the reason Jack Rackham took my crew. I said not to follow! Jesus, you've lost your head, man! It's a fair exchange for finding these flintlocks and grenados. Listen, Vane. We can hunt with those guns. <laughs> and I mean to! Up, and I'll have to kill you, Vane! Bloody try! By all means!
It's either you or me who's leaving this island alive, Welsh. Because I'm not going to sail again in a world cursed by your ugly boat. Nancy boy, you only done half a fucking job. Fucking hell. Is this my reward for believing the best about men? For thinking that a bilge rat like you could muster up some fucking sense once in a while? Maybe Horner Gold was right. Maybe the world does need men of ambition to stop the likes of you from mucking it all up. <laughs> or maybe. You just don't have the stones to live with no regrets. <laughs> don't save me a spot in hell, Shanka. I ain't coming soon. Stealing a fishing schooner single-handed. Damn canny, Captain. As is taking back my brig from this pillock. Once again, I thank you both. This Billy Huff didn't last two months with your ship before he came limping back to Nassau. Took the pardon straight away. I had to, lads. That Rogers was on to me from the first. Hold your tongue, Rackham. So what now? Still chasing your elusive fortune? Aye, and I'm close. I've heard the sage is sailing out of Kingston on a ship called the Princess. Put your ambition to better use, Kenway. Find the sage with us. I've no stomach for you and your mystics, Mary. I want a taste of the good life. An easy life. No one honest has an easy life, Edward. And it's aching for one that causes the most pain. All right, Rackham. Back to retirement. news are they? This Bajan works for the Royal African Company. Tell him what you told me. I haven't seen the princess for eight weeks or more. Meaning she may soon be back. What else? I thought this buck 
belong to the other man who was asking about the princess this morning. So I told him that... What other man? A potty sailor in plain rags, and a gent with a scar just here. Where have they got to? Staying just round the corner, they said. I grow tired of chasing these fantasies of yours, Edward. As does a crew. Hang in there, man. We're getting close. Wow, it's this kind of hotel. I don't want to do this kind of hotel. Oh, it's over. Raise the alarm. I就好办了。再有个目标吗？就是破坏警钟哦，两个警钟都破坏掉。准备，我看一下地图。待会往这里走还需要，还有很多人的。找出那个跟罗杰斯。Let's go. I'll just get the people who need to deal with the road. Let's go. Soldiers waiting for us at the crossroads. Very good. If you don't mind me asking, sir, what's the meaning behind these blood samples you're taking? Torres tells me that blood is required for the observatory to properly function. How do you mean, sir? If one wishes to use the observatory to, say, spy on King George, then one would require a drop of the king's blood to do so. In other words, a small sample of blood gives us access to a man's everyday life. Does Torres mean to spy on me then? For I've just given him a sample of my blood. As have I, Captain Hornigold, as will all Templars. It is a measure of insurance. And trust, I reckon. Yes, but fear not. Torres has shipped our samples to a Templar safe house in Rio de Janeiro. We will not be the observatory's first subjects, I assure you. Why, sir? I suppose it's a small price to pay for what the Templars have given me in return. 
Precisely. Governor, when you hunted pirates in Madagascar, what methods were the best? I believe it was my charisma that persuaded them. Violence and threats should always be a last resort. In Madagascar, I offered those pirates a choice. Take a pardon and return to England penniless but free men, or be hanged by the neck until dead. Just as you did in Nassau. Precisely. A pity Commodore Chamberlain did not live to see my thorough success. It's not like you to glow, oh, We all deserve a moment, don't we? I don't converse with dead. Shove off. Master, welcome. Africa, 
winds do not favor that. I concur, Grandmaster. I should have sailed there myself. One of my slave galleys would be more than capable of making a swift journey. A slave galley? Captain, I asked you to divest yourself of that seeking situation. I failed to see the difference between enslaving some men and all men. Our aim is to steer the entire course of civilization, is it not? A body enslaved inspires the mind to revolt. But, enslave a man's mind, and his body will follow. Be natural, efficient. A fair point, Brad. Africa we look. Principe, sir, a small island. We've sent two of our best men, Burgess and Cochrane. Privateers with fast ships and firm hearts. Edward Kenway! Imagine my surprise at seeing your jackdaw anchored there. Have you heard all you came to hear? Will you now rescue the sage from our clutching hands? A pox on you, traitor! You sold us down river. Because I found a better path. The Templars know order, discipline, structure. But you never could fathom these subtleties. Goodbye, old friend. You were a soldier once, when you fought for something real, something beyond yourself. Bay quartermaster, the sailing for the coast of Africa. Incoming cat! Fire! Fire! 
Look, Captain, the whole place it's shot down. Oh, there he is, Lou's down. Had some win. All sails. He'll take it. Loose tops and royals. Cliff dead ahead, sir. Not far now, Captain. All in the stun. I'm off to find Robbins. Don't stay long. Who's getting restless out there? Just愉快的突突突的时候又到了 终于不用潜行了。我记得这里有火药桶，对，等他们走到这里。Hello。是不是很爽？一个火药桶炸死了那么多人。等等，我看一下完美同步条件是哪些？好像没有。不去，对的。Captain Kenway. Yet another dire situation, Roberts. We really must stop meeting like this. Stop tailing me and your wish had come true. There's no need for this. You know I'm as good as my word. Our Captain Howell was killed today in a Portuguese ambush. Headstrong fool. I warned him not to go ashore. It was orchestrated by the Templars, Burgess and Cockrum. The same sort that took you to Havana. Ah, I see now there is no escaping the Templar's attention, is there? I suppose it is time to fight back. I do like the sound of that. And I know just how I'll do it. But these men, Burgess and Cockrum, they cannot be allowed to leave with word of my escape. They won't. Count on it. If you spot any men from my crew, do them some kindness and send them here. I'll do all I can. Okay. Easy. Hello.
你看不到我，你看不到我，看不到我。看不到我，你看不到我。就是这样，很简单，急救。接下来我们要双重暗杀，在此之前呢，先把这个给解决了。好的，跳，哦，你跳去哪里？这里应该有信仰之月的地方吧？前面。双重暗杀，双重暗杀！我、哦、这好多火药桶哎，爽爽爽！你可以等他们都站一起的时候一起解决的，这样这样效率比较高。我把我要我要把左边这两个解决。看到我的，哎，等等等等，好戏来了，好戏来了，好戏来了！看这么多人是不是？这这么多人扎堆在一起，哦、<笑>我是不是<笑>一起把他给扎死了？哇！ Two, three. You did us good, Kenway. Proved yourself a true bravo. And for what? His own bloody pride. You stepped in the path of my prize. Not a thing a man should do. <laughs> a cocksure, Cully. Just like Hornick all said. That Templar scab means nothing to me. None of you do. And you're worse for it, Kenway. It were the Templars who took us in when all else went to shit. Not our king. Not our country. The Templars. The Templars is our family. Where's yours? <clears throat> In honest service, there are thin horns. Your wages are due. Yet, as gentlemen of fortune, we enjoy plenty and satisfaction, pleasure and ease, liberty and power. So, what man with a sensible mind would choose the former life, when the only hazard we pirates run is a sour look from those without strength or splendor? <laughs> Now, I have been among you six weeks. And in that time, I have adopted your outlook as my own, and with so fierce a conviction that it may frighten you to see your passions reflected from me in so stark a light. But if it's a captain you see in me now, I then I'll be a bloody captain. Yeah! For I have dipped my hands in muddied waters, and withdrawing them, find it better to be a commander than a common man. You fatten with your assistance, looking for the observatory. Folks say you're the only man that can find it. 
books are correct. Despite my distaste for your eagerness, I see in you a touch of untested genius. I'm Bartholomew Roberts. Edward. I have no secrets to share with you now. But if you'll lend me your aid, in two months' time west of the Leeward Islands, well, it's there you'll get some answers, I promise you. Funny that. With scurvy, the fix is more pleasant than the cause. When you catch a dose from a horn, must treat it with quicksilver. You're fonder of getting the disease than you are of curing it. Something biting at you. Oh, all men desire to live by a code or a creed, yes? Yet when pressed, most defer to their instincts rather than the laws that bind them. What is the appeal of a creed? It does not yoke all men to like behavior. Might make a man feel like he belongs to something. What's your answer? Ah, oh, that all men are sheep. That an old wolf like me deserves every ounce of blood he draws. Sail to this location. Bring only those you trust.